Hello, I am Gelina and I'm going to present our work, Lipnerf. This is a joint work between Stony Brook University and Amazon Prime Video. Let's start with an example. In many cases, we have an original video in English. He has chosen a path. It's the right path. And we just replace the original audio with a dubbed version in a different language, like Spanish. Ha escogido un camino. Es el camino correcto. We can always notice that the lips are out of sync in this case. In this work, we address the problem of lip syncing, also called audio driven talking head video synthesis. Given an input video and a target speech segment, we would like to produce a photorealistic lip-synced video of the input speaker. Ha escogido un camino. Es el camino correcto. Prior work can be categorized into gun-based approaches and nerf-based approaches. Gun-based approaches leverage large video datasets with multiple identities, learning a large variety of audio lip representations. However, they only operate in the 2D image space, and as a result, they cannot handle large head pose variations, leading to artifacts in such cases. On the other hand, nerve-based approaches learn a 3D representation of the face geometry, but they are only trained on limited video data of a single identity. As a result, they do not produce as good lip synchronization as guns. We present LipNerf. LipNerf bridges the gap between the accurate lip synchronization of guns and the accurate 3D face modeling of nerves. It is conditioned on the 3D MM expression space instead of the audio feature space and achieves a high lip sync quality for challenging HD videos of cinematic content. So let's see how this works. During training, we have the input video frames of our input speaker. For each video frame, we fit a 3D MM and extract the corresponding head pose and expression parameters. At the same time, we learn per frame latent codes in order to capture the appearance of the talking face for each video frame. All these condition a dynamic nerve that learns an implicit 3D representation of the talking face and outputs the RGB color and density of each 3D point. These colors and densities are accumulated through volumetric rendering in order to output the final video frame. During inference, we only have the target audio available. As a result, we have to learn an audio to expression mapping. We do this using a pre-trained GAN-based method namely wav to lip that outputs an intermediate video frame. Even though wav to lip often produces artifacts or blurry results, our 3DMM fitting successfully captures the expression and lip position at each video frame. The extracted head pose, expression and learned latent codes are passed to the dynamic nerve in order to synthesize the final lip synced video. In some cases, we have noticed a head-torso separation. This happens when the source phoneme is very different from the target phoneme, and as a result, the synthesized head is separated from the neck. We fill the missing neck region using a generative model for in-painting, pre-trained on human faces. We collected a dataset of HD talking faces from movies with corresponding dubbed audio in different languages, including French, Italian, Spanish, and German. To the best of our knowledge, there is no such dataset publicly available for the purpose of cinematic dubbing. Please note that cinematic content is more challenging compared to other public datasets for lip syncing due to large head pose variations cinematic lighting, and expressiveness of the actors. Let's see some results. 
This is the result of our method lip synced to Spanish dubbed audio. Ha escogido un camino. Es el camino correcto. Es un camino hecho por el principio que conforma un carácter. Dejémosle continuar su andadura. Ustedes tienen el futuro de este chico en sus manos, comité. Es un valioso futuro. Another example, also lip synced to Spanish. Eso creo, ¿verdad? Y usted vino a arrebatármela, ¿es eso? Pues le compartiré un secreto, doctor. Puede quedársela, yo ni la quería. ¿Cree que es un privilegio ver morir a jóvenes? ¿Para qué estoy discutiendo con usted? No sabe lo suficiente para estudiar el agua hervida. ¿Cómo se atreve a juzgarme? An example in German. Sie können die Wahrheit doch gar nicht vertragen. Junge, wir leben in einer Welt voller Mauern und diese Mauern müssen von Männern mit Gewehren beschützt werden. Und wer soll das tun? Sie? Sie, Lieutenant Weinberg? Ich trage... And another in Italian. E tutto questo fa parte di un piano più grande. Ho sentito anche questa. E la mia preferita. Dio ha guardato in basso e ha visto una rosa bellissima. Così bella che l'ha voluta prendere per averla per sempre in paradiso tutta per sé. In terms of the quantitative results, we evaluated the lip synchronization and visual quality of our generated talking head videos. Our method demonstrates a significant improvement in lip sync accuracy over AD nerve, and it is in the top three state of the art approaches. It also achieves the best visual quality overall. We also evaluated our method for different clip lengths for training. We notice that LibNerf achieves a high lip sync quality even when trained with very short video clips, even as short as 3 seconds. However, sometimes 3 seconds may not be enough. They can result in motion blur during emphatic head movements of the input speaker, which is resolved using just 20 seconds for training, compared to 3 minutes required by other nerf based approaches. In conclusion, we propose LipNerf, a novel nerf-based method that performs lip singing in the 3DMM expression space. It achieves high lip sync quality for HD videos of cinematic content, outperforming the current state of the art, and it handles challenging variations in head pose, illumination and expression that frequently appear in cinematic content. Thank you.